It's almost 700 days since the referendum. Mm. It's around 400 days since your government triggered Article 50. Yeah, you still can't tell us what the government's preferred option on customs is. Why not? Well, we're working up two options, as the Prime Minister has said. Um, we've made progress with the transition deal, uh, which has been very much welcomed by uh, the city and other business leaders. Right, but why can't you tell us, after 700 days since the referendum, you still can't tell us what the policy is, can you? Well, we've sat down the Prime Minister out in the Mansion House speech two options. Uh, those need detailed workings, uh, and that work so is ongoing in government. after 700 days, you're still at options? rather than the actual policy. Well, there's two detailed proposals. Uh, they went before the Cabinet Subcommittee last week. And it didn't uh, that decide. Is right. Well, it's proper that we have these detailed discussions. Well, for and how much longer? As part of the partnership, we've got two options that the government are working on. Shouldn't up, you have and made up your mind ongoing. before you triggered, uh, triggered Article 50? You triggered Article 50 and entered into a vast black hole in which you've still yet to make up your mind. No, we set out very clearly uh, what we're seeking with the European you, Union, which is a, an you, ambitious... Excuse freedom. me, Minister. You have not set out very clearly. You cannot tell me what your policy is today. It is. Our policy is to seek as frictionless uh, a trade agreement uh, as possible with the EU. And that's that is not a policy. In the that's interest an aspiration. Of, well, What's the policy the to achieve that? Well, that is the policy. That is in the interest of both sides. The Prime Minister has set out two models by which we can achieve that. It is right that Cabinet meets to discuss those options and further work is going on in order to assess those. Mr Johnson says the Customs Partnership, uh, which is one of the two options, is crazy. Do you agree? Well, the Foreign Secretary signed up to uh, those two options uh, as part of yeah, the but he cabinet. says one is crazy. Is he right? Well, well, for the Foreign Secretary to address it, but the point is that he agreed, as the Cabinet as a whole agreed, that these two options would be worked up by government. Uh, and part of what business are looking for is as frictionless a, a, a set of arrangements what, as What business is looking for is for you to make up your mind. The, the Business Secretary, Greg Clark, says that without the Customs Partnership, which Mr Johnson says is crazy, Thousands of jobs will be lost. Is he right? Well, it's important that we get the supply lines in place. It's important that we have the right trading arrangements. So is he right? Well, in, well it's, it's key to businesses, uh, to all businesses. But which one is right? Get... Because they both can't be right. One says uh, that it's crazy. The other says if we don't do it, thousands of jobs are at risk. Well, you, well, who's let right? Let me address it. I'll answer it, which is the fact that we need to look at the two options. There's two ways of approaching this. That is what the Prime Minister has set out. Uh, and further work is ongoing yeah. on those two options. Well, but yeah, but one is crazy, one thousands of jobs are at risk. Who speaks for the government? Well, the Prime Minister speaks for the government and the Prime Minister... But we don't know her out, view. Uh, we do. Uh, that was set out uh, in the Mansion speech. And we can see from the economic no, uh, no, figures the, the today... The Mansion House speech did not tell us what the customs practice would be. It listed some aspirations. Now, is she in favour of a customs partnership, like the Business Secretary, or is she not? Like Boris Johnson, which one is? She's it? in favour as frictionless agreement with the EU as possible, ensuring that businesses are able to maintain their supply lines, uh, and that is in the interest of both sides. That's in the interest of Europe, as it is the. We UK. all know that. What we're trying to work out is what's the policy. I know these 